good thank you very much sleepy ways chicho chicho this may be unrelated um, it's more of a general advice I've been really passionate about building my skills around music producing but I became a little compulsive and obsessive during the pandemic about it do you have any advice for being passionate for skills building but also patient enough to not force yourself uh, by putting extra pressure I think I just have uh, high expectations I want to be good blah, blah, blah. Uh, so here's the kicker sleepy waves there's a fine line between uh, letting your passions overwhelm you and take control of your life and you sacrificing other things that are important in your life to just being very passionate and very committed to what it is that you're doing I have no problem by being compulsive and obsessive to a certain degree because I am when I do certain things right We're seeking that perfection to a certain degree or trying to learn as fast as I can so that I can roll out something being new that I want to do right but I do have this thing that I built for myself or sort of a commandment that I have or a mantra that I have for myself which is I'm not seeking perfection and it's the same rule that I have for my students I tell my students I don't care if you get 100% or not right but 80% is the bare minimum so 80% is my line where if a student gets lower than 80% then I say okay we need to do extra work to kick it above 80% because that 20% you can you can get if you put more work into it right 80% for me is do you understand the concepts right now I know it's a little different when you're producing work because you want to put out the best work that you can but just creating all this content over the last 15 years right I realized that no matter how many times and I've reshot some of those videos that I've loaded on over the last 15 years multiple times right like we're talking not a five-minute video that I was shooting but a two-hour video that I was shooting I would shoot the video look at the video and i would go no i can do better and i would do it again and then sometimes i did it three or four times right i don't have a problem with that that just means you're practicing to improve yourself now if you're doing that for an extended period of time for multiple months or multiple years then you sort of have to reevaluate what it is that you're doing so don't be too hard on yourself when you're becoming sort of compulsive obsessive about something that you want to do that's fine but you draw the line where you forget to take out the garbage maybe not for the first week but the second time if you forget to take out the garbage because you're totally obsessed with what it is that you're doing right now you're doing it wrong the garbage needs to be taken out if you if you forget how to eat or if you forget not how to eat but if you forget if you forget to eat right and you're getting headache because you're dehydrated then it's time to take a break and walk away if you're sitting in a certain posture and your muscles start cramping up and you're you're having back pain and stuff like this then you need to go for a walk and it's always a good idea to do that because you can reevaluate sort of loop whatever it is that you're doing in your head and pick out the problem areas right sometimes the best way to improve your work is to take a break from your work right so there's a whole bunch of techniques you can use um, and the more you do the more you learn right like some of the like seriously I've waken up over the last I don't know whatever number of years I've waken up in the middle of the night having a solution to a problem that I had right and sometimes i get up and go to the computer and do it and i you know get up and sometimes it's a five minute gig sometimes it's i get up at two o'clock in the morning and i'm working away until 10 a.m right and then it's time to catch a little break it's different for everyone we're all different creatures some people need eight hours sleep some people can function on four some people need to go for a walk our body structure is different some people's body structure you need to stand up and stretch every 20 minutes okay 
so just see where you are man don't be too hard on yourself but you if you see see yourself sacrificing some of the more important things in your life or some of the must do's in your life then take a break <laughs>